Hey guys, Lex here, back for some more Digimon Survive. Last time we started part 3, everyone was arguing about whether to explore or stay put. Then we started free action and I got distracted with catching Digimon, which I really want to right now, <laughs> so it's starting this again. Uh, but yeah, let's continue talking to everyone. I want to talk more with uh, Lobmon and Saki. It's Shuji. What is he doing? Why do you always look so sad? Hey Lopmon, what are you doing? Oh, I'm catching food. I'm going to get as, I'm going to get as much as I can, then give it all to Shuji. That's nice, I hope he appreciates it. Yeah, <laughs> I hope so too. I bet there's more than over there. Let's check it out. Wait, no, if we get too far away, it might put Shuji in danger. Oh, right, sorry about that. You really are looking out for Shuji, aren't you? Yeah, fighting scares me, but Shuji is important to me. Given how Shuji treats him, that's really admirable. If only he could see that. Yeah, he's a real old jerk. Oh, got something. Oh, huh, what's this? Clobber carrot? Whoa. Huh? Shuji, what are you doing out here? Oh, I thought maybe I could find some food. Nuts. Or wild vegetables or something. But we've still got plenty of food and I thought you were against exploration. I am, but I wanted to do something to help out. But besides, I can always run to safety from here and having more food can't hurt. It's not like there's anything else I can do to contribute. Well, I don't think that's true. He's doing his best, I know that. And I can appreciate that he has a strong sense of responsibility, but this seems like a waste of energy. Not that I could come right out and say that. Uh, yeah, let's help him out. It's gotta be hard to do all on your own. Here, let me help you. No, I got this, damn it. <laughs> You've got other stuff to do, don't you? Leave this to me. Oops, that backfired. <laughs> damn it. <laughs> By the way, Takuma, did you get one of these garbled messages as well? Oh yeah, you too, Shuji? That's right, I can't call, but illegible messages like that get through just fine. So weird. How in the world can this be happening? Oh, Shuji. Here. <gasps> oh, Lopman, where have you been? I went to get some nuts. Wow, look at all these. Great job. Oh, I never asked you to do that. You keep away from me. I'm sorry. Poor Lopman. I realize Shuji is scared of Lapmon, but this just seems cruel. Can we get Lapmon? What? Okay. <laughs> oh, Tsaki, I wonder if she's gotten used to this place. Let's talk to Floramon. Floramon, you get along well with Shaki. Have you two always been like that? Well, when we met, we were constantly on the run, so there was no time for fighting. And you know, Saki can be fearless. Yeah, I think I get what you mean. Speaking your mind without being afraid of what others might think does take courage. But don't you think it's normal for us to get along? After all, you two seem pretty close. You bet we are. Oh, sure, but we didn't start out that way. I mean, I was pretty scared at first. So was Minoru. I think only Aoi and Labramon started out on good terms like you two. Oh, yeah. Aoi seems like she's pretty brave, too. Eh, <laughs> that's the problem with you boys. Oh, I guess I can't really argue with that. Well, what matters is that you're getting along now. Try to keep that connection. Right, you know, you're surprisingly well put together, Florimon. Hey, what do you mean surprisingly? So rude. Yeah. Oh, Takuma, come here, wouldn't you? I could use someone else's opinion. Hey, what about me? Oh, right, sorry. It's funny though, talking with you feels like talking to myself, Laramon. It's weird. Hehe, <laughs> what's that supposed to mean? I don't mind joining you, but are you sure you don't want someone else? I'd take anyone at this point. <laughs> 
Maybe you can tell, but I get lonely pretty easily. I feel like a lot of girls are like that. I get lonely too. Does that mean I'm a girl? No, you don't seem much like a girl to me, Agumon. Still, Ali told me she likes reading by herself, so maybe she doesn't get lonely. Huh, speaking of lonely, how did Haru and Miyuki survive here all alone for so long? It's weird, because even if it's a little different, sitting here in the cafeteria, eating lunch like this, makes me feel like it's been all a bad dream. Wow, I've never seen a sentence go through two text boxes. <laughs> wouldn't that be nice? Then the professor wouldn't have... Seems like Saki is still upset about the professor. Maybe I'd better leave her alone. Hey, talk to me about something, would you? Huh? That'll help get my mind off things. Oh, okay, uh... I guess if she wants to talk, we should talk right... Uh-oh, that's four things. Oh wait, that's no, the same four things. <laughs> so how does all this make you feel? I don't know, so much crazy stuff has happened. I feel like I'm about to explode. To be honest, this is all way too much for me to deal with. I'm really not sure how to react. The best thing I can do is just think not think about it all. If I'm sad, I'll cry. If I'm scared, I'll scream. That's good enough for me. Uh, sure. I can certainly understand how Saki feels. We're all basically in the same boat, myself included. I let myself dwell on things I'd be frozen with terror, so I hold on to hope. I need to keep pushing forward, otherwise I might end up like Ryo. Um, did I lose you? Oh, sorry, there's a lot on my mind. I get it, honestly, if I weren't careful, I think I'd go to pieces. There's more. How's our situation? Look, I don't really know about our current situation, but... Here's my take. Remember what Mew said about the curse when we first met? Yeah. I, th I think that was true. You, uh, think so? Could that really be true? Creatures we've never seen before. Strange, troubled messages. Sounds like a curse to me. Oh, you get one of those messages too, huh? They are kind of creepy, aren't they? At least everyone's here. If it weren't just me, well, I'd tear up just thinking about it. There's more. What's going on? So, what do you think is actually going on right now? Should I know? Yeah, I hear you on that one. Well, whatever happens, it's gonna happen. What matters is how we act when it happens, right? Yeah, that's true. What's our next move, boss? So, what do you think our next move should be? I really don't know, pass. I'll leave the thinking to you and Owie. Me? Why me? What do you mean? You, don't you usually make the final call? <laughs> uh, do I? Maybe you're right. Well, thanks for sharing your thoughts. It was helpful. Good. It helped me take my mind off things, too. Thanks, Nagama. Alright, I better get going. Sure thing. Good luck. Make sure you take the time to talk to everyone. Will do. See you later. Who do we talk to next? We talk to Shuji again? No, oh, I really want to do the battle. <laughs> Let's talk to the ghost kids. There's Miyuki and Haru. Should I talk to them? I don't think I explored this room yet. Accordion's been thrown on top of the desk. Parts of the bellows are torn. How long ago was it left here? I couldn't guess if I tried. Huh. Yeah. All the portraits on the wall look musty and faded. Some of them are tilted or have fallen to the floor. Wow, are these people old professors of the school? Wow, drum. Drums have been placed haphazardly. All of the drum heads are discolored. I'm guessing they haven't been used for a while. Quite a while. Yeah, no. The grand piano is covered in dust. Looks like an antique to me, but the sound is clear and crisp. Oh, well, let's talk to Haru first, if I have to talk to them both. Hmm, Haru. And Miyuki, too. What are you two doing? He's wrapping a string around his fingers. It almost seems familiar, but why? Cat's Cradle! Alright, the old game you play with a string. I'm surprised you know how to do it. Sister loves this game. Hmm. Oh, okay. 
He says that, but it looks to me like he's playing and Mika's just watching. How does it work? I want to play too. Tie a string in a loop, and use your fingers to make shapes. But it might be hard with fingers like yours. Oh man. R seems relaxed. Has he given any thought to what might happen next? Then again, he's still pretty young. Maybe it's best he plays quietly by himself. Uh... Stop playing games! <laughs> Wait, this is actually a important choice, or a moral choice. <laughs> How's this wrathful? Any thoughts, Miyuki? So, Miyuki, any thoughts? Hmm. Uh, you know, about whether we should stay here or look around outside? Does it really matter? Um, Haru, I was talking to Miyuki just now. In here, out there, they'll attack. They'll find nothing. Either way, it's the same. Well, <laughs> you actually answered. Miyuki! <laughs> <laughs> She's asleep. That was fast. My sister's tired. You should let her sleep. Uh, yeah, I guess. You should worry about yourself more than me. Oh yeah, go and take this. Oh, thanks. That was a big help. Big band-aids. Alright, Agumon. We better head somewhere else, you know, quietly. You got it. Uh, let's see. 19 moral? Damn. Surprised I got so much moral. I'm just surprised that my choices are considered moral. <laughs> oh, it's Ryo. He looks a bit worried. What was I saying things? No, that can't be it. Then we're actually... Ryo, what's up? Shut up! Get lost, would you? Hey, that was an actual response. <laughs> goo goo. Are you feeling better now? What do you mean, better? You act like there's something wrong with me. Uh, well, look, in a way, I feel like there's something wrong with me, too. I think you could say that about all of us. Hey, if you got nothing to say, get lost. I thought he'd lost it earlier, but now he's talking with me just fine. What kind of state is he in right now? How do you feel? Shut up. It doesn't matter what you say. Ah. I can certainly understand how Ryo feels right now. He must be worried sick, and we're all just kids. There's nobody for him to rely on. There's more. How's our situation? Look, you're just a stupid brat, so you probably don't get it, but... Our situation, our situation is... Damn it! Oh, we're so screwed! Yeah, that's it. That has to be the afterlife. Oh, we died? He's not looking at me anymore. Guess he's back in his own world, ugh. There's more. What's going on? So, what do you think's actually going on right now? Shut up. Whatever's happening, it doesn't matter. Well, he may be talking, but I see he's as prickly as ever. There's more. Is there next move, boss? Okay, what do you think we should do next? I'm telling you, who cares? Whatever we do, we're just gonna die. Well, I can only speak for myself, but I'm not planning on dying here. Sure, we'll all die someday, but that's way into the future, when we're old men and women. It's not what I'm talking about. Ah, oh, you idiot. Well, at least I got to talk with him. He'll be okay, right? Is he really alright? I'm worried. Go, go. I know how you feel, but I'm not sure what to do either. That's it. It must be. I mustn't say anything. There had to be ghosts. Yes, that must be weird and we're ghosts too. <laughs> what should we do with Ryo? I can't just leave him like this. And speaking of which, we're leaving him like this. Oh, whoa. Neutral. Oh! Oh! <laughs> okay, I have to do this battle. Yeah, Doku Gumon. Gah, woo! <laughs> Mouth 
seems perplexed by the sight of a human. Uh, smile and wave. No, he does not like that. Blaster seems hostile. Me eat you, okay? Sure thing. Yes, you eat now. What? Monsters flying into a rage. Oh man, no good. How are we friends? <gasps> uh, okay. Doesn't seem to be in the mood. Oh well. I guess we gotta murder him. Smile, laugh, right, right, trust no human. Uh... Come on, join my team. I need to catch you. 28%, come on. Maybe I have to be more wrathful. Does she have four attack? Nope. Holy shit. Wait, what level are these guys? They're six. Ow. Pit trap. I'm <laughs> cool. Don't you think every day is just so bad? I wanna <sighs> uh, join my team. Come on, this is like the tenth, twentieth one I've fought. <laughs> I'm gonna get one of you someday. Uh oh. Oh shit. What does he do anyway? Triple forces. What's that guy doing? Hey Takuma, have you seen Falcomon anywhere? I haven't, no. Don't tell me he's gone this whole time. That's right. At first I figured he'd be brought back, so I wasn't worried. But now he's been gone so long, I'm starting to think maybe something happened. Hmm, that's weird. He seemed to have lost track of Algamon too. Yeah, I don't see him anywhere. And don't you know where he went? Beats me. Knowing Algamon though, I doubt he'd go far. Right, maybe. I just need to wait and Falcomon will come back too. He says that, but I, but I can tell he's still worried about Falcomon. At least he's not crazy enough to go out looking on his own without Falcomon. Minero will definitely get lost out there. Still, I wish I could reassure him. We need to have fit. I'll keep an eye out. 
Well, I'll be sure to keep an eye out. I'm going around to school anyway. Yeah, that's great. Thanks, man. Oh, but don't let it distract you from talking to everyone. Besides, you never know. He might come back on his own. Right, got it. Anyway, I'll keep waiting for a little while longer. Cool, I'll be sure to send him your way if I see him. Great, thanks. Hmm, that's weird. Hey, Kudimon by himself? Now I can catch him. Come on, what's he doing? I wonder. Wait, where's Agumon? I can't talk to him without Agumon. What are you doing by yourself? Where's Ryo? Kiro, Kiro. Oh, sorry, I can't tell what you're saying. <laughs> Wait, I think I can guess, though. Ryo must still be in bad shape, huh? Is that what you've decided to go out for a walk? Man, if only there was some way for us to communicate. Oh, well, I know. Why don't you try using gestures? Kiro, Kiro? Yeah, the way you were tilting your head like that, I could totally understand. How can I put this? Why don't you try using movements to show me what you're thinking? Kiro, Kiro. Yeah, that's an odd. This might just work. Why'd you leave Ryo? Are you sure it was safe to leave Ryo? I know he's in rough shape, but should he be alone? Kiro. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm not blaming you. No need to look upset. After all, the others are into school too. So it's a lot safer in there than outside. I'm sure there are times you'd like to be alone. Hey, that reminds me. Agumon and some of the others are missing, too. There's more! <laughs> have you seen Agumon? Hey, Kumon, have you seen Agumon or any of the other missing person? We're looking for them. Q. What? Doesn't that go to the shrine? You mean that's where they all went? Q. But why? What's there to do at the shrine? There's more. Why are you here? What brings you here, Kumon? Kiro, Kiro! What the heck? A circle? No, something big? Or is that some kind of outline? Hmm. <laughs> Sorry, I don't get it. <laughs> Where are you going? There's something you want to do here? Or are you heading somewhere else? Kiro. He's pointing. That's easy enough to get. Let's see. That way would lead to the shrine. Why do you want to go there? Kiro, Kiro. Hmm, what's he doing now? Shaking his head? Staying alert? Looking for something? Hmm, so I don't get it. Kiro Kiro. Huh? What? Are you saying I should follow you? I don't know, I feel like going into the forest without Agumon will be dangerous. But if that's where Agumon and the others are, I would like to go bring them back. Right, that settles it. Take me to Agumon and the others. Kiri! No, what's going on? Can't believe this is where everybody went. Hey, Agamon, where are you going? I'm not going anywhere. Look, there's something here. Hey, what are you all doing? Oh, talk about this way. Why are you all of you out here? I just got a feeling like something was in there. Something like what? Hmm. Be on your guard, everyone. There's definitely something there. What? What is it? I can smell something. We have to be careful. You know what it is? No, I'm telling you to be careful because I don't know. Whatever it is, it's certainly a creature like us. But we can't say if it's friend or foe. See over there? Something's rustling through the bush. Wait, don't get any closer. It could be dangerous. Let's watch from here. Oh no. <laughs> well, there's Lopmon. Oh yeah, I could switch areas. Hmm. I could talk to Lopmon. Do you have to talk to him again? Let's just go through the sus- Oh yeah, I was supposed to check for suspicious things. That's what I was doing. That shadow- Oh shit! Fight. Open something new. 
Oh, it's one of those robo guys. What's his name? I forgot. Andromon. No, Andromon's the. Uh. Oh, wait, there's also two Gatsumon? <laughs> Perfect. Let's talk to Gardromon. Looking at innocent monsters really puts your heart at ease, doesn't it? Oh, love the nice. They're so. Wait, what a gentle soul. I guess you don't. Oh. Sometimes you should act on emotion instead of logic, don't you think? No. Be true to yourself. Don't dis- Damn it! If your friend was off causing trouble, how would you deal with it? Uh, with my fists. I see. <laughs> okay, I guess he likes those kinds of answers. Don't you think everything's just boring, Yawn? down, uh, definitely lose. Feels so good. Help. Oh, I was just kidding, gotcha. Well, he scared me. Hey, my friend. Fine, finally! <laughs> oh my god. Forever. <laughs> now I can get another one. <laughs> Just in case. Hey, let's get for two in a row. <laughs> Yawn. There's a treasure chest here too. Tell me to Javolf. Damn, I can't reach it. What are you doing here? Actually, let's check the library. Finally. Rock monster with a powerful defensive abilities, armored in the ore data from its habitat. This selfish monster becomes a handful when anchored, rampaging like an erupting volcano. Oh, he turns into Gartramon. Wait, Numamon? Okay, so I only needed two. Cool. Now let's actually look at this thicket. Look, look, Takuma, there's something there. Whoa! What 
really tripped out. Let's go, Mama. What's with that thing? Are you sure it's not going to attack? It appears wary of our presence. Look, it's hurt. Maybe that's why it's upset. It's been glaring at us the whole time. What should we do? Talk about We have so many big bandages. Shouldn't we treat its wound? That's probably why it's so agitated. You're so kind, Takuma. You sound just like Howie. Are you sure? That creature's wounded. It might try to, to fight back. <laughs> Looks scared of us. Maybe it, it's the injury. I'm sure it'll see we mean no harm if we take it slow and steady. Okay. Are you gonna join our team, Gomamon? Oh yeah! Hey, Kakumon! Yeah, let's check out another profile. Wait, that's the wrong thing. Yeah, let's check it out. Marching fishes! Yeah, I want that Ikakumon. Oh, he turned into Shellmon, too. Uh, guess we could talk to Lopmon as the last one. It's Lopmon, but Shuji's nowhere to be seen. And why does Lopmon all look so sad? <laughs> Huh? Lopmon? What are you doing here? Are you by yourself? Yeah. Where's Shuji? I tried calling for him, but he wouldn't answer me. Oh, sounds like you got problems of your own. Takuma, how do you feel about us? Huh? You mean about you, Agumon, and the others? Right. Uh, <laughs> strange. Strong. Strong and cool. We're all so strong and cool. It feels awesome to know you're on our side. No matter how big and tough our foes are, you guys are always managed to beat them. So we're just weapons to you? I don't think that's right. Hey, that's not what I'm trying to say. Laban is concerned about his relationship with Shuji. I know that, but... There's no way I could know what to say that would help them. All I can do is say how I feel. Lapman doesn't seem satisfied, but what else is there to say? Yeah, you're not my partner. Go back. It's almost lunch time. Better get back to. Hakuman, you're back. Hakuman, this is huge. You won't believe it. I won't believe what? It's really big and shiny and just unbelievable. Big and shiny? What are you talking about? A satellite? Uh, oh, I was a truck monster. Oh, yeah. Oh, right. A radio tower. Oh. A what? Oh, you mean a radio tower? I quickly got everyone together, and they were all thrilled by Agumon's discovery. Those towers send cell signals, too, right? If we go there, our phones might start working. Oh, sh scared me. And I bet from a tall building like that, we could get a great view from our surroundings. Just how tall is it? It's super tall. Oh, come on, you saw it too, right? How tall would you say it was? Super. <laughs> Well, it's hard to say with no comparison, but it was taller than the school. If it's that big, then there's no doubt. Do you think it's working? That I do not know. After all, none of us have ever heard of these towers before. Well, if we went there, we could find out. Who knows, maybe there's someone there. Yeah, seeing we are talking about it isn't going to do us much good. That sounds like we're in for a hike. Let's do this, Aoi. A hike? What do you mean? What kind of hike? Oh, you don't know. The tower's on top of a mountain. Through the forest, no remote pass. What? You mean we need to go through the forest? You can't be serious. This place is crawling with monsters. Just exploring around here will be risky. 
ちょっと待って。<笑><笑> I'm, I'm going with you, Lebron. Will you come with me? You bet I will, Aoi. Wait, Aoi, I thought you agreed. You should stay here. If, if that tower has a soul signal, that would mean we could contact the teacher. We could talk to everyone, even call for help. C call for help? Yes, and then wait to be rescued. Are you really still against the Shuji? You tell him, Aoi. And hey, that means now a majority of us wanted to explore. I'm interested in this tower too. That puts me, Minoru, Saki, and Aoi in favor of going. So, what now, Shuji? But, no. Shuji must really not want to go back out there if he's still not convinced. If only there was some way to win him over. Uh, he has to get his way. Why was he supposed to explain? No. Maybe. 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 Agumon, did you spot anything that seemed dangerous or that might attack us on the way? Not to worry, we didn't get attacked once. We didn't catch a whiff of anything suspicious either. So it's not dangerous? Sounds like a no-brainer. You really think it's safe? I guess, in that case... Ah... Uh, well, if you all want to go, I guess there's no point in me trying to stop you. Yeah. Okay. See ya. Bye. What are you talking about? You're coming with us. What will you do if a monster attacks and it's just the two of you? Let's not forget, neither of you have a partner monster. Indeed, you will not let any harm come to you. And I'll help keep you safe too. Never one to be left out, are you? <laughs> yeah, I come out like this all the time. <laughs> oh, and Rio, you'll look after the place while we're gone, won't you? Wait! Don't you go leaving me behind. I'm going too, okay? <laughs> oh, come on, Rio. Why oh, are you so uncooperative? You can't handle being on your own. Oh, it's alright. At least he's finally back to being the real we know. It's been a little off lately, but, but the guy's supposed to be bigger than Krabby. Yay. Adventure time. Following the directions from Agumon and the others, we emerge onto a mountain path. Wow, a different background. There's a big bridge. Whoa. Hard to believe this place was right here, so close to the school. Alright, I think I'll stop here, and next time we'll check out the radio tower. Thanks for watching, see ya, bye!